Hello, I'm Dudley Thompson and welcome again to WDT Media TV and today we're going back inside the vault to tell you that Daryl Vaz has filed a lawsuit against Dr. Dayton Campbell and also the of Justice Delroy Chuck have this message for Jamaicans who are convicted of gun crimes and also David Crawford is having the last laugh. This and more, stay tuned, don't touch that dial. Minister of Transport, Darrell Vaz, has filed a lawsuit against Dr. Dayton Campbell for the statement he made on a political platform. Take a look. Years ago, when we were in government, we had to give Andrew Holness the leader of opposition extra security because there was this argument that Darrell Vaz, James Roberts, now out the lines won't get man to kill him. And I live to see James Roberts and Darrell Vaz stand up in a parliament and compound by decency. Minister of Justice Del Chuck has his message for Jamaicans who are accused or convicted of a gun crime. Based on the amount of evidence I am providing you and the police that the sentence of 15 years can be significantly reduced depending on the amount of evidence. Otherwise, police find you with a gun, you go to court, you're going to get 15 years minimum. So help the police, help the nation, let us know where you got the gun, who provided it, and where the police can find more guns. All right, and welcome back. Damian Crawford, some years ago, when he wanted to run for a constituency in Portland, and he said he went and he, it took him three years to come up with a plan how to bring the youth in the area um, to be more self sufficient. And he said he came with the idea of goat farming. When he put the idea to the constituents, he was mocked, he jeered, ridiculed, and said, No, no goat around no here. And they called him Goatman. When he walked past, in the area, they were like, nah, Goatman I come, Goatman. He was ridiculed mocked in the area. And right now, Damon Crawford is having the last laugh. Why? He's now a successful goat farmer. Here is Damon Crawford with his story. And these are goats belonging to Teen Peace Damon Crawford. And some years ago, when he proposed to have goat as a project in Rural St. Andrew and also St. And he was ridiculed. It was called Goatman then. But now Damon Crawford is having the last laugh because you know you know running a successful goat farm yeah. in Jamaica. With over five hundred goats. And they explained earlier yeah, yeah, yeah. if you have thirty but a goat you can earn about one point two million dollars Jamaican dollars. Per year. And it has over 500, so do the math. The one that we have is a upper one, Jim. Damon Crawford. You know, a successful goat farmer in Jamaica. These are goats belonging to EPNP's Damian Crawford. Remember some years ago, he was proposing to have goats as a project for persons and he was ridiculed. And now Crawford invested personally is now a successful goat farmer in Jamaica, Damian Crawford. He owns over 512 goats. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it says Jamaicans can earn up to. If you have 30 Look goats, you can earn up to 1.2 million. The one that we have is a upper one team. Yeah, understand. Mm. So, how am I getting a goat now? 
I go run by election. The man, the PMP man, dead on a Portland, and I go run by election. I sit down three day and write one plan. What me that do for making people them life better? So, to Portland, I have enough grass now, enough push. I come up on a thing where say Jamaica import two billion dollar worth of mutton. That's a two thousand million dollar, you know. So two thousand, mm. we could have make one million dollar from where Jamaica import. So we eat as curry good. Mm-hmm. So the two them have the grass now. I go down there and say, yo, me nah go to nothing free other than me give you a goat. I make down here so be the goat place. Mm-hmm. People them say, no, we don't want no goat. Then start calling me goat man anyway. Then see me then say, man, yeah. <laughs> them deal with rabbit. So <laughs> them deal me away now. I come so now. I'm easy for shame, you know. Mm-hmm. But when me shame, when me shame, I'm not hiding now. When me shame, I prove you wrong. So I come so now and say, all right then, I'm going to start it and show the people what could I do. Because, let me tell you, them trick with the belief say only rich people own something. But the truth is that who own something rich, no people don't see the difference, you know, but it's a big difference. You see, if who rich own something, then who don't rich don't feel them for own nothing. Because we don't rich, so therefore if a rich people own something, we know if have nothing. But if we own something rich, then if we want rich, we have to demand ownership. So when you look for most who rich, them get land from them granny and from them father, and then get business from their hunty. They own something and rich out tight. So mm-hmm. when you look for the bold, you own a talent and rich out tight. Um, bunny shark. So who own something rich? So me, I say to people now, make could train our children to own if I even want goat. Make you own a goat and see. What come out of the goat? If you own a chicken, I can see what come out of the chicken and how ownership means something. Because all we train is to go work for people. It's not for own nothing. See? Mm-hmm. And one time you're sick and dead, you cannot give your picnic your work. You can't give your picnic your business. So mm-hmm. my little youth, my daughter, she have at least have 500 goat. Come here, 500 goat. So if she forget it right now, she have 500 goat. If you work on my farm and dead, your daughter not get nothing. Still my goat. You never get one goat. You understand? Maybe me give you one figure cook for your nine night you used to work for me. So mm-hmm. me can give my child something when me did my effort captured in a that, you know. All of my day when me go down then I son a captured in a how much goat in a how successful in a the name when me establish. You understand? Just like how Jamaica producers name and effort captured, just like how Grace Kennedy captured. Grace Kennedy said, I'm a hundred year old. That means that somebody just started hundred years ago, you know. Mm. That them not enjoy it now, you know. But for them pick me, I enjoy it. Enjoy. So, if we you know, come me now, I'm catch up with Stuart. But maybe my grandson will catch him up if me give him a good start. So, mm. that is what I said to the people. Them, even who I watch now, own something that I mean, say, I will stop work. But have a look at you just upon your, upon your veranda, maybe your youth. Have a look at shop, your youth, you turn it in a wholesale. You understand? So, me now comes to now and decides to make a buy. So, I buy 40 goat now to go show people say it can work. So, I buy 40 goat and have them downstairs in the same house. I stand up and I video them. So, you see me have video this or no? Yeah. I, 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 so, you watch them to see who's sick. Because they're enough. If you, mm. if you, if you bungle up, you know, and go see who's sick. So when them mm-hmm. I walk past now, you hear me say, yo, see one day up a rare race, see who see. So I put them in the house now and I got through all of the pains of learning, enough dead, rare, rare, rare. But that's how life got. You have to learn, you have to lose. You have to, you have to lose and learn and gain. And then now I go start buy more and them start pregnant. If you have 12 goat, you make $600,000 a year. If you yeah. have 12. See, if you have twelve, if you have, mm-hmm. and you know, sell the mother, you just have to sell the picnic then. Cause twelve mother goat can give you two, two and a, so that can give you thirty goat for the year. Twelve mother goat, and you have thirty goat for the year. See, a thousand two hundred dollar pound right now, and one goat I go give you all fifty pound, fifty five pound. So that means say, uh, if you look on it, you can make one, 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 one. What that? 55 pound times thousand. You can make 50 grand a goat. See? I don't take out the expense, but as I show you the total. And you have 30 of that. See? So that means you can make one 1.5 million. You divide that in a two, then you say half of it expense and half of it profit. 
See? Come in back grass boat eat mean. So right, they say you make one six hundred thousand. Mm. Out of twelve boat. You understand? No. Yeah. That that that's the simple part. Cause maybe the whole of them dead. Maybe all of them born. Cause me, me, one time I have sixty kids were dead in. You know? Sixty. Yes, sixty kids were dead. Cause other goat trample them and all of them something there. Me I feed them like oh you know like how you feed baby. But you want him to stay, him have to have him head up. You can't turn him upside down in here and like baby and feed him. You understand? Um, <laughs> drought coming down the grass. Nothing not totally easy, you know. Me the love to talk to the man who start dress Kennedy. Kennedy. Thinks that the whole of him can't be if them did all right. You not think him did have no day when ball and fix. <laughs> you understand? Talk to the brother with own calls. The man says syrup him used to walk and sell in a brother. Mm. Until he comes and start him calls drop till him got calls catch up. Till right now, the man they a a a a, a lick out last cup. So when you build your thing over time and you learn, my youth them never have these struggles. Cause me never teach them that. When me learn, when me lose. You see me. So me come so now and start build my thing now. Jamaica people start to say, yo, look like like the man did see something like the man was a genius and people start come hardly shall come to my place and me feel proud, but. I lose enough, man. I lose millions to learn. Because I don't know about goat, you know. Remember I told me growing up. But I just start learning it now. I'm a goat man for real now, you see me? So, um, I just that. Form for sustainable growth and wealth creation. We need many, many more projects like this one. Congratulations on property. Thank you. And thank you for Damien Crawford emphasized that politicians are humans and they have issues, problems, challenges, just like us. When I'm gonna say, boy, Mr. Crawford, I'm stopping at the stoplight, you can't just give me a bills. You haven't bought groceries yet. Yeah. You understand? Yeah. Um, so, so you don't pay your light bill. And, and, and it's more embarrassing for me than for people when nobody knows. You, you get me? I mean, with those negatives, you understand? So when a man come and say, yo, your light cut off, it's more embarrassing for me than a, than a man with John Brown. Yeah, you understand? Yeah, you have, you have worried if I'm going to tell other people to depend on social media. So, yeah, sometimes when you go through your Gideon and other people are, are going like, you're, you're, it's impossible to be broke. It kind of gets on your nerves. <laughs> you understand? Yeah, yeah. But I, I, even this is great, great um, sacrifice I have to make. I tell people when I build my house, sometimes you buy steel and don't eat meal. Yeah. Sacrifice I have to make. Um, I've never been accused of a thief, and as thief as anything politicians are, it's not that easy. You got thief, you understand? You have a mortgage, you also have to do all the things. So when I don't sell my females to grow my farm, I mean half of my products are being retained. Yes. But now in the money for that, must have six units of value for every unit of pay. Right. So if I pay you ten dollar, you must make me sixty dollar. That is other than that, we not hire you. So therefore. Why would you want to take four units of the six units that you create instead of one? So, so, but yes, man, there you have it. I'm Dudley Thompson as usual. And again, thanks for watching. And please like, share, and subscribe. And have yourselves a wonderful day.